Well, it's ever more about the storm. However, all these trees we've been talking about making pasture, they're the guy that's actually hauling all this pine out of here actually called and said he's on his way. We'll be here tomorrow morning. Well, that's a lot of work for us. So we've got to get these pigs moved and the chickens, we tighten their nets up too. So we got to get these pigs out of the way so that way they can work in this area. Once they get done, I can move the pigs back in. But right now I got to get the pigs away from where they're going to be. So we got to get that done real quick. The American guinea hog are always at the very back. <laughs> Well, that went a lot easier than expected. Aiden let them perfect. We got these tighter in these two nets. Now, usually we double both of these sides. They get more than double and then they get more than double. But for right now, all these trees here are gonna get cleared out. So what we're gonna do is tell them to work all this side first. And once they clear that out, what we'll do is just turn around and move all of them back. Cause they can still cut all this without any issues too. Cause we have a ton of wood that just needs to be cut because it's actually getting to the point of, you know, these pines are huge and big enough. And then we got some junk gums and stuff that's not gonna do us any good. We'll cut them and we're gonna leave some of these nicer oaks to stand and that'll be shade trees for the cows one day. So it's just a rain, Aiden's getting the charger moved over there. And then I'm gonna go ahead and get the water and the fencing moved. And that way this will be out of the way for them to cut here first. Okay, that project is done. We've got the pigs right there. We've got the chickens and turkeys and uh, ducks right here. So that's good. That means all this is done. So now they can get to all this timber and get this cleared out. Because man, this is gonna be more pastures for more cows. So that's gonna be great. So what we're gonna do to establish that though, is again, still work the pigs in here. And they all disc it and we're gonna basically put seed and hay right behind them every time and that helps start it one good thing is we're going into uh, kind of a, a fall winter season so i'll be able to plant ryegrass ryegrass grows real quick and that'll help establish the rottening of that pine mulching and it'll help start establishing a good ground for the spring grass to come get start getting established when we seed it next year so plants always prepping for next season always prepping for the next thing I want to show you a nifty little thing that, um, well, say thing, it's a clock um, that we have in our playroom that we've kept in here. I found it really handy. It is a Smart Pro projection alarm clock with a weather station. Now, the cool thing that I really like about this is not only does it tell your time and everything, but the outdoor remote that I have outside on my front porch is projecting the outside temperature and the weather forecast. So one of the things that I really like about this um, clock is that it also will tell me the time and temperature. Now, we, this is our school room and before I got a clock, I did not have a clock in here. But the coolest thing that I like about it is when we're in here, we're doing school work. The summer we know deep south, it's hot, but when fall comes and we get done with our school and we're ready to go out instead of me trying to find my phone get to the weather out see what the weather is all i have to do is glance over and see what the temperature is so that will tell me very quickly if my kids need a jacket if they don't need a jacket in other words how we need to dress so i found that to come in very much handy and you see the date and the time and the day listed on here there's the outdoor remote, but it also has the indoor temperature listed on here as well and a forecast projector. Now, we haven't really done a whole lot with that, but I really like this um, alarm clock in my, in my school room, mostly because one, I didn't have a clock in here, so I was always trying to hunt down my phone. Two, it tells me the outside weather, which is a huge thing for our school room and knowing how my kids are going to need to be dressed when we get done with school and we can go outside 
Also wanted to tell y'all I have talked to Smart Pro and if you guys want projection alarm clock with a weather station, we have a discount code for you guys. I'm gonna put the link to our Amazon store in the description along with the discount code and that is for you guys. All right, we're actually getting our, our steak out of the refrigerator and our hamburgers out of the refrigerator. We have ate a lot of our own beef, of course, the last few days, but we've not had the steak. So I'm excited about the steaks, uh, just because who else can get a steak for 2 or $3 a pound at this good quality of grass-fed, uh, non-GMO raised beef. So let's get it right quick. Happy homesteading, y'all.